Hi everyone, this is Liz. Welcome back to Home Decorating with Liz. Today I am participating in the Pumpkins and Candles Tablescape Challenge 2019. This is being hosted by Mrs. V and Everyday Living with Karen Jeter. They have asked us to create a tablescape for the fall using candles and pumpkins. I will have the links to their channels down in my description box along with the playlist so you know the deal you guys when you finish watching my video please head on over to their channels and give them some love and watch all of the participants videos from the playlist okay let's get started okay here is my pumpkins and candles tablescape I'll first give you an overview of the table before we get into the details Starting in the middle, I have a bed of florals and some leaves from outside to bring out the natural greenery. I have some pine cones that are in there as well. Some over here. And I have all of my cute little pumpkins surrounded around this tablescape. And I have a pepper and salt shaker. <laughs> How cute is that? Little owls. And now I have a few books that I wanted to stack here because I wanted the pumpkin to be elevated slightly. So I added those. And on top of the books, I have a fall sign that says, Hello Fall. And I just put that there for extra height. And here is my pumpkin, Give Thanks. I think this pumpkin is so pretty. I love it. It's one of my favorites. Then the tablecloth is a red sheer leaf tablecloth that I found. And I forgot where I got this from, but I think it was Ross. And when I saw it, I had some kind of ideas in my head, but I said, I'm going to use it probably for fall. And I think it's so beautiful. So I'm using it here. Now the place settings. I have a brown charger. I have a leaf plate that I got from the Dollar Tree and these little small little leaf little plates with candles in each of them. That's how the plate looks. I'm pretty sure a lot of you know, you've seen these. And a red tea light. I have my gold flatware that I'm using. Dollar Tree leaf glasses, which is so pretty. I have four of these at the four seats. And the heads have different ones, and you'll see that in just a second. And each glass is sitting on a silver bling glam coaster. For the napkins, I'm using some green and mustard colored napkins. I just folded them that way. And I have my bling napkin ring holders that are from Totally Dazzled. I sure wish I could have gotten the leaf one. She is selling napkin rings that are um, shaped in the um, leaf, but they ran out. She sold out, so I couldn't get them, so I had to just use what I have. And this is the head, so this has a different glass, the one that I DIY'd, and this is a different coaster. And I'll give you a long view of the table. I'm showing you the back of the table. 
not much different from the front but you can see the pumpkins a little bit more and I have some leaves that are scattered all around the table pretty much around the centerpiece and here is the other head same cup as the other chair and the two heads I have a large candle this one is leaves and this smells so good this is from Bath and Body Works and it smells delicious so nice here's the other candle at the uh, head I forgot to show you this one is called see if I can pick it up without burning myself oh boy it's apple pumpkin normally I don't like anything pumpkin but if it has apple in it I can do it okay everybody I hope you like this tablescape this completes the collaboration challenge I would like to thank the hostesses for coming up with this challenge this was really nice thank you so much ladies and if you're not yet a member of the Home Decorating with Liz family, please join me and click on that subscribe button right now. Click on your notification bell so that you will be notified whenever I upload videos and you won't miss any of them, okay? And to all my faithful family members, thank you guys so much again. I love you all. Also guys, I can be reached on social media. Please follow me at Facebook at Home Decorating with Liz. Instagram and Pinterest at Home Decorating with Liz. I would love for you to follow me. Love you all. Thank you so much for watching. You take care and I will see you next time in my next video. Have a blessed day. Bye-bye.